newspaper taxis appear on the shore Waiting to take you in the sky with diamonds track three from sergeant pepper's lonely hearts club band way back in 1967 and a john song that he wrote after his son julian had been painting a nice picture at school and john said what's that julian and he said it's lucy in the sky with diamonds now lucy was a friend of julian's because julian was only about five at the time so just a little children's painting and uh, John thought, wow, that's a good time, uh, name for a song. And he decided to write a song about it. And then if you look at the first three letters, Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds, they spell out LSD. So, of course, everyone naturally thinks, oh, he's hoovering up LSD. So the song must be like, must be written about LSD. But apparently, according to John, it was just Julian's picture. But you believe whatever you want to believe. The point is, it's a great song. So here we go. This is how to play it. So I basically kept the song in its original key. So it kind of um, changes key uh, in the chorus. So we start off in the key of A. Picture yourself in a boat on a river. And then for the chorus, we go to G. Lucy in the sky with diamonds. Um, so, um, but the chords are actually pretty simple, apart from the B flat, which I know a lot of you won't like. But... Um, Persevere with it because it is um, it's worth learning and it's also worth doing the song in its original key because we've also got the little riff that we can use as well. So first of all, here are the chords. So A major, first finger, first fret, third string, second finger, second fret, fourth string. And then we've got an A7. So that's just first finger, first fret, third string. Then we've got a D major. First finger, second fret, fourth string, second finger, second fret, third string, and third finger, second fret, second string. Then we've got an F major, first finger, first fret, second string, second finger, second fret, fourth string. Then D minor, to make the D minor, you just gotta add your third finger to the second fret, third string. And there you go, you got a D minor. Next up, the dreaded da, 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 B flat. First finger pressing down on both the first and second strings on the first fret. Second finger, second fret, third string and third finger, third fret, fourth string. Then we've got a C major, third finger, third fret, first string. Then we've got a G major, first finger, uh, second fret, third string, second finger, second fret, first string, third finger, third fret, second string. Good. So that's all the chords that we need. Now we need to have a look at the strumming pattern. Bear in mind that this song is in two different time signatures. For the verses, it's 3-4, so we're in waltz time. And for the choruses, it's in 4-4. Four, four. Very typical John Lennon, that. It was always changing time signatures mid-song. Look at other examples. All you need is love and uh, good morning, good morning. Lots of different time signatures. Break. Always 
sort of can you kind of keeps you on your toes and takes you off guard as well it's brilliant I'll, that's one of the reasons i love john lennon's uh, songwriting okay so verses this is what i do down 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 just keep it very simple and obviously putting the emphasis on the first downstroke one two three one two three down 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 so that's the uh verses taken care of because they're, they're quite um they're quite quiet and then everything builds up for the choruses so you don't want to do anything too complicated for the verses just keep them really gentle you might even want to strum with your thumb picture yourself in a boat on a river then we get to the choruses now what i'm doing here is because we're in 4-4 four four and it's quite an ebullient uh, and strong chorus i'm going down 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 up down down so this is what i do down 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 up down down so if we play the chorus lucy in the sky with see how it fits in with that 4-4 four, four beat. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So that's the strumming. But before we go into the main song, I want to teach you the little riff because it's a beauty. As George Martin once said, um, I think it was the making of Sergeant Pepper documentary, he said Mozart would have killed for a little riff like this. beautiful little riff so i'm going to show you how to do it so what we do is we start off on the fourth fret third string then we're on the fifth fret second string then seventh fret first string so you've got like that now we're going to go on the seventh fret third string seventh fret first string then fifth fret second string then a sixth fret third string, fifth fret second string, seventh fret first string, and then fifth fret third string, and then the next bit is the do do do. So we're on the fifth fret first string, fourth fret first string, and then fifth fret second string. This is one of those cases where you might want to slow this video down a little bit by using the three vertical dots, at the top right hand side of the video. Press on that, it'll take you to play black, playback settings, go to playback menu and go to uh, playback speed, slow the video down to 0 0.75. That should be able to slow the video down enough for you to be able to take in what I'm playing because it is a little bit complicated. So I'll just get closer to the camera, here we go. And what I do is I play that twice at the beginning of the song just to um, just to establish it, really. I think it only does it once on the main main song, but um, it is a beautiful little riff. Picture yourself in a boat on a river. So if you can play it and sing it at the same time, it takes a bit of doing, but it does sound nice. What you might want to do as well is get uh, some of you clearly players to play the little riff and some to play the chords. So you've got two different sections of ukuleles playing two different things. Anyway, now let's have a look at the main chords. So we're on the main verse. So we start off with an A major. Picture your A7, self in a D, boat on a F, river with A, tangerine, A7, trees. And D, marmalade, F, skies. So you do two bars on the F there. Now we're back to the A. Somebody, A7, calls you, you D. Answer quite, F, slowly. Uh, a, girl with car, A7, light a scope, D, eyes. D minor. 
now we go to the B flat. Cellophane flowers of C, yellow and green. Now to F, towering over your B flat head. Now to C, look for the girl with the G, sun in her eyes, and she's D, one strum on D, gone. Boom, boom, boom. Now we're into 4-4 four, four with the chorus. So we go to the G. So don't forget your down, 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 up, down, down strum. So we go to the G. Lucy in the sea sky with D diamonds. G. Lucy in the sea sky with D diamonds. G. Lucy in the sea sky. With D diamonds. Ah, back into 3 4 for the next verse on the A chord. Fall over A7 down to a D, bridge by a F, fountain where A, rocking horse A7, people D, marshmallow F, and don't forget we're on the F for two bars. Everyone A7 smiles as you D Drift past the F flowers But A grow so in A7 Credibly D high D minor Now to B flat Newspaper text is a C Peer on the shore to take you a B flat way. C, climb in the back with your G, head in the clouds and your G, the D. Gone, bum, bum, bum. Back into four, four times. So down, 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 up, down, down with your strumming and onto the G chord. Lucy in the C, sky with D, bam. G, Lucy in the sea, sky with D, diamond. G, Lucy in the sea, sky with D, diamond. And back to the A. Picture your A7 self on a D, train in an F, station with A, plasticine A7, porters with D. Looking glass F ties. Back to the A. Suddenly A7, someone is D. There at the D minor turnstile. Oh, sorry, F there. Sorry, I got that wrong. There at the F turnstile. Back to the A. A girl with a A7, Linus go D, a D major. Now we just do one strum this time on the D minor. Bom, 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 bom. And then we straight into the chorus. So back on the G and with your down, 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 up, down, down strums. Lucy in the C sky with D down. G, Lucy in the C sky with D downs. G, Lucy in the C sky. With D diamonds. Ah, back to A. Ah, G. Lucy in the sea sky with D diamonds. Ba 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 ba. G. Lucy in the sea sky with D diamonds. Ba 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 ba. G. Lucy in the sea with D diamonds. So the actual song does fade out at the end, but um, it's always nice to provide a bit of an ending to a song when you're uh, learning it on an instrument. OK, then. So that is the song in its entirety. So we've got the little riff at the beginning and we've got the verses in 3-4 and the choruses in 4-4. Four, four. Right. Are you ready to have a go playing this with me? Don't forget the chords. And the lyrics I'm posting in the description to the this song. So if you just 
tap on the description. All the chords and lyrics are there, including the little riff as well, the, the opening riff. So if you want to play along, feel free to do so. So here we go from the top. So what I'm going to do is count in one, two, three, one, two, three, and we're going to go straight in with the riff. One, two, three, one, two, three. Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds, played on the ukulele in its original key. So there you go. So if you've got any songs that you'd like me to teach you in the near future, just leave me a message in the comment section. I'm probably about halfway through the Beatles back catalogue now, so there's still plenty more to get my teeth into. So if you've thought of one, maybe something like I Am The Walrus, maybe, just let me know and I'll uh, put a lesson down as uh, quickly as possible for you. Take care for now and all the best. And don't forget, keep on string strumming even.